What's happening guys? What's going on? Welcome to another video of Ride with Raj. Today is a vlog. Yes, a lot of people like where are the vlogs and vlogs are back. And why are they back? Sun's out. Yes, it was raining continuously for 6-7 days. Finally, the sun is out. I think I'll be able to get my motorcycle out because I have a couple of meetings. I'm going to a store also to check some gear because a lot of people like we want to know about jackets. We want to know about the right riding wear. Ladakh season is on. People are riding and people are asking me when am I riding. I'm riding soon. Uh, however, I'm planning to do some mods. And there's one more thing. Yes, so I received this package from Banggood and uh, let's quickly open it. I'm not gonna review it I'll review it later because there are more than five cartons here full of products so I'll do that later right now gotta step out yeah so I know it's not an unboxing video but I'm quickly doing it can you guys guess what this is yes it's a body armor a lot of messages that in rains it's very difficult to wear thick jackets so here you go guys, I have a body armor now um, and yes I'll review this separately, it does have a back brace which is good. So I'll review this product separately, stay tuned for that. So if safety is concerned and if you're looking for a body armor rather than wearing a whole jacket, you can just wear this and put a windsheeter over it or just a t-shirt over it. So this is really cool and I always wanted one, I never had a body armor of my own. So finally I have it, I'll review it separately, stay tuned for that right now, let's proceed. I'm just done with the meeting and I'm going to Ghatkopar because Decathlon is in Ghatkopar. I'll let you guys know why I'm going to Ghatkopar Decathlon. The meeting was awesome. Yes, I'm reviewing some jackets, some helmets, some boots, some gloves soon. So stay tuned uh, for my next ride. And I'm at Jumbo Vada Pao right now. I've not had this since ages. So let's try. I didn't know it's become so variety full, man. That's awesome. So let's eat it. Okay. So why am I going to Ghatkopar, Decathlon, why not Varbi, why not Thane? Because in Mumbai, the last station of metro is Ghatkopar and the beginning station is near my area which is Varsova. So I can straight go to Decathlon in metro very easily, enjoy and if it starts raining, I'll be fine. That's why I chose to go to the Ghatkopar one and not the Thane one or the Varli one or the Vashi one. So let's go to Decathlon and enjoy my Indian burger. supposed to shop but spiker has a sale and I got one jeans free with another jeans so my one pair of jeans is for 2800 something approximately 1500 for one pair of jeans and I always like spiker because spiker fits me the best so I bought two pair of jeans I want one black and one blue black one I'm wearing right now because I'm a fan of jet black jeans I, I don't have a pair of jet black now so I bought this check this out This is the blue one I bought, it's awesome and I like this finish and it's stretched denim which I really like. So today turned out to be a shopping day. So that's the penny board and that's the nickel board but that's not the original brand, it's from Obzello. So this is better actually I have this one which I'm using you guys already know about that but this one is better. So this cool buddy actually showing me all the skateboards and longboards here and Decathlon has a lot of new collection and I'm trying a, a mix of both stunt as well as a uh, kind of a corner, carving. Ca carving board. Uh, the advantage this board has if you see is there's a nice ridge here so the tire has the ability to go all the way there if you're really into deep cornering and carving basically so let's try this board first i already tried the penny yep okay i can't shoot myself now but i 
<laughs> so if you want to start cruising, um, if you are like a kid size, go for this. I have this one. The reason I bought this one is because it goes in my backpack. It's easy to commute. Um, and this I tried is fantastic. So you can spend around three thousand four ninety nine if you're good getting into cruising. Uh, these are really nice, but this is ultimate. I really liked and thanks a lot, buddy, for that advice. So if I would ever go uh, for carving, this is the best. And if you're into long boats, they have that as well. So it's pretty sorted. So in Rajdhani, we have dal bati, churma. Maybe I'm very hungry, but the taste of Rajdhani Thali is amazing. So my visit to this mall is fantastic. So I want to ask all my subscribers who are watching this: Has anyone finished this thali ever? I could not finish it. I failed at this, and you also get your own wash basin. So I just asked him, and he said that there are a lot of people who finish this thali and also order more food and finish it. <laughs> so we are howlers actually. So the majestic thali in Rajdhani is for four forty rupees. If you come on Tuesday, it's for two fifty or something. All right, so that was long day, and it started raining, and that's why I didn't take my motorcycle. Though I started it, and yes, my engine is getting corroded, which I'll show you guys. But right now I'm at my house. I'll go down again. Before I go down, I wanted to talk to you guys. So here to this clip, very carefully. So a lot of people are asking me that why am I not riding? Why am I not going places? Yes, my next ride is gonna be the longest ride, which is planned. Whenever I contact my subscribers, suppose in Mangalore, uh, someone somewhere else. they all say it's raining a lot so don't come and uh, yes i can ride in the rain there is no problem in riding in the rain the problem is i can't get good footage okay if you notice very carefully okay i had removed my camera even for today so that i can go out and do a little bit of motor vlog in fact i was planning to ride all the way to ghatkopar which is as good as going to lonavala from my place uh, but the thing is it just starts raining and on gopro it's it doesn't it doesn't justify the videos don't justify If there are some vloggers, they'll understand what I'm trying to say. Okay, as simple as that. Because uh, the camera is so small, and even one drop of water falling on the lens makes the whole thing blur. And the video has not come out good, so I could not do it. I did get wet, I you know, but didn't make sense. So I have a lot of product reviews happening. A lot of people asking you're doing so many products, but guys, these are all motorcycle-related products, and you guys need that in future also. So maybe the product videos which I am actually producing will be helpful for fellow riders who want to buy new gear and stuff like that, right? So I have more than 15 products right now lying in my house. Okay, uh, I'll just quickly line up few products to show you guys what I'm doing next, so you all will have an idea what I'm doing about. This is the first time I'm featuring products in advance before doing it. So after doing the auxiliary lights video, a lot of people asked me and commented that, hey, can you tell us which is the best auxiliary light, especially for rains, fog, and everything? I was always looking for a combined solution because a lot of people on Himalayan and Kawasaki versus have equipped multiple lights for fog as well as uh, spot beam. and uh, that actually eats up the battery power and this explanation was done on my instagram story so if you're not following my instagram unboxing please follow you will get all the updates uh, about the right uh, details i also explained how a relay is very important uh, to be installed when you're installing auxiliary lights so these auxiliary lights are by color auxiliary lights yes they do have a yellow light which is amberish and they also have the white beam okay so this will be highlighted in my next video along with this there is also a headlight which i'll quickly show you guys but it's square 
This is the headlight which I am planning to do some mods with and that's the reason I have it. I will share all the details in my next video when I review these lights. Uh, they are very nice. Yes, this is dot certified. So this is the advantage of this light because it is bicolor. As you can see, there are around 8 LEDs which are amber and 8 are white. Yes, you also have a switch system uh, in which you can actually control the yellow, control the white and make all of them on also. So you can have a yellow white breaker also which can kill the fog as well as spot beam so i really like that and yes uh, it does come with extra wire housing and switches which i'll explain in my next video now you guys must be curious about my shopping the jeans i'm actually already wearing let me show you guys the denims are from spiker and i got a pretty decent deal the tag is still on you guys can see so in 2800 rupees i got two pair of jeans uh, stretch material so it's very comfortable especially for biking and stuff like that and i'm actually wearing it right now to see how it feels and yes i do have some awesome boots which i'll review later yeah and i did buy a lot of things from decathlon i bought a t-shirt i bought two pair of gym shorts which i really need i also bought my most favorite half sleeves black shirt which i have white and olive already uh, but i didn't have a black one so i bought a black one this is cotton because in rains it gets humid right now imagine it's raining and i'm sweating it gets very humid so better to wear 100 percent cotton which is very flimsy and thin that's what i like comfortable wear is more important and now i will show you my favorite t-shirt which is more for summers and if you want to ride and you want to wear a summer t-shirt inside your jacket i think this is really cool this is from decathlon so this t-shirt is really nice you can see that the armpit area has uh, more of breathable net which i really like uh, does have a reflective line behind so that you know it reflects when you're doing your jogs and stuff like that this is specially i bought for outdoor running yes i'm gonna start running my fitness is gonna get back fit buddy will have more videos too if you've not checked my fit buddy channel please check it out the link will be in the description it'll be very helpful if you subscribe to it because i don't have much subscribers on that so i'll quickly wear this all right so this is how the t-shirt fits it's really nice it's very flowy very thin material which i really like i also like the armpit area is so open so it can breathe you won't sweat much especially when you're doing your runs and uh, this is how it is this is how it fits comfortable a uh, little flimsy material which is nice i like the armpit area is open so you'll have good breathing when you're doing a run goes even well on your denims if you want to just wear it casually outside for a coffee or something and if you feel it's too humid uh, wear something like this you can wear a jacket on it and start riding so it's a very very nice t-shirt i really it's a little expensive it's for 699 uh, but trust me it's worth it uh, please do not send it for ironing you just need to wash it and keep it the way it is just fold it and it's good enough because these are made with that kind of material if you're into running and if you're into jogging and stuff like that this is amazing uh, and i also bought these shorts which are really cool uh, they are also by decathlon uh, most common ones they are very comfortable so they'll actually go very well with my whole set these are also really cool shorts they are a little shorter so that when I'm doing leg exercise like squats and stuff like that this will be very good and uh, it does have a nice elastic on top so uh, this is overall what I bought I bought four products and it costed me around 2000 rupees I want to talk about something else but we'll do that near my motorcycle so let's go down minimum battery is working so basically I can kick start it uh, but as you can see starter is not working and if you look closely you guys can see this kind of corrosion happening on my engine yep so this is how it starts and what I need to do is I need to get a nice uh, engine polish uh, powder to scrub it so that it immediately goes away but I should do it quick within couple of days if I don't do this uh, this will get inside the pores basically every metal has porosity so this will go inside the metal and then the junking starts happening so before that starts happening see it's happening even here this area you can see very clearly so yeah i need to clean it so yes i'll do that but before that let's kick start this bike wow one kick okay shut in one kick water in my petrol tank too because uh, it was kept outside I just got it in and 
the rest looks good so that's the current situation of my motorcycle today i will because it's less rain i will do the buffing cleaning and everything i think that noise is a lot let me shut that well this is all that happened in this video today and yes it is not your typical review so i thought i'll break the ice by doing kind of a lifestyle vlog which i am doing in my regular life uh, shopping and basically showing my bike condition showing some products which is coming soon and yes that bike color light really got me excited and i thought i'll review that soon stay tuned for that but the main reason which i'm going to announce is I am not going for long rides because of this. All right, would you like a footage of blur images? No, right. So please hold your horses, cause this time I'm going on an excellent motorcycle. Yes, it is a nice, uh, high-powered motorcycle which I'll be taking along for a long ride. So stay tuned for that. That will also happen, but be patient because ride with Raj is your friendly neighborhood rider, right? <laughs> Anyways, cutting the story short, the most important thing which I'm about to announce is a lot of people ask me that why aren't you reviewing any other brands besides Royal Enfield when it comes to jackets? Well, I have a DSG, I have other jackets and you guys already saw the armor which I got recently that will be also reviewed. So basically there are three products which approach me. Yes, out of the three products, two products, I could not work with them is because one of the products the quality was not that good. The second product, he does not have so much of inventory that he can supply to all my subscribers. The third product is really interesting. In fact, today I did not introduce that in the vlog is because I want to feature it specially. So the concept is simple. I will motor vlog and go to these three different stores, pick these merchandise, wear them on and do a kind of a review about it also. So I think that's a cool concept. If you like the concept, please mention below. Yes, the concept is cool. So I'll get inspired and I'll do that video. Otherwise, I'll do the same typical video of holding a jacket in my room and showing it around, which is also not bad, right? Okay. Any which ways, I will go on the motorcycle, pick up these products, try it on. And I think the jacket is fantastic. And guess what? It has a level two armor. Yes, finally, I have a basic category of jackets, which is nominal price, which all you guys can afford with the level 2 armor and that's why i'm really really excited about doing that video so well this was it and i hope you like this video if you like it press the thumbs up button if you're not subscribed my dear friend there is a red button right down there and press the bell icon because a lot of people say we don't get any notifications so press the bell icon and you'll get my vlogs regularly and as usual guys eat well sleep well be good signing off ride with Raj.